Later this afternoon, I will join my daughters and their families for an early dinner. It's a special Mother's Day for us because it is the first Mother's Day of my youngest daughter, Rebecca, who had her son, Domenico, last June, almost two year old. But as many of you may know, the original Mother's Day was not about flowers, cards, and a special brunch or dinner. It was about mothers marching for international peace. Joy Ward Howe, a Unitarian who wrote the Union Army song, The Battle Hymn of the Republic, also wrote a Mother's Day proclamation, imagining a day when all women would stand up against war so that no sons would be killed and no mothers, wives, fathers, sisters, or daughters would mourn. I know this original impetus for Mother's Day is still the hope of all mothers everywhere, as well as all people everywhere even if it seems so far off. So let us join together for Mother's Day prayer. Creative and loving spirit, may each of our hearts and minds in this quiet moment be touched by inward peace and calm. May each of our spirits, souls, and hearts also be touched by love and by the infinite peace. May each of us know that we are precious, that we are blessed, that we are loved, held in the arms of loving kindness. May we each find acceptance here for who we are. And through this acceptance, may we each enter into and create this prairie community of care. May each of us go from here later this morning a little lighter, touched by hope, touched by joy, touched by laughter and tears. May we find healing here for our wounded spirits and forgiveness for ourselves for when we have failed so that we also might learn how to forgive others. Let us contemplate together peace and hope, imagining this spirit bringing a moment of peace to all in the world. And in all that we do, may we always begin in peace and in kindness. Amen. 